Does anyone know what sense around is? You know, who know. Tell us, Mr. Audio. In 1974, Universal Studios released the film Earthquake. To enhance the experience, the audio equipment manufacturer Servo and Vega, working with Universal, developed a sound system to create low frequency effects to simulate an actual earthquake. The sense around system they created introduced movie audiences to the subwoofer. It worked this way. Instead of mixing the rumbles, which could be as much as 35 dB louder than the dialogue, into the movie's soundtrack, sense around used 25 Hz and 35 Hz control tones that could trigger two different effects. These tones could either be at low levels on the mono audio track, or for some prints could be on separate audio tracks. The frequency and volume of the tones would trigger a pseudo-random noise generator that could, when coupled with the amplifiers and subwoofers, create an earthquake-like rumble at 120 dB. Sense around in some ways is similar to Fantasound that was developed in 1939 for the Disney film Fantasia in that tones on the control track turn the amplifiers up and down. Initially, it was proposed that sense around might even have dust fall from the ceiling during the earthquake scenes. However, and perhaps very wisely, they chose not to do that. Theaters had to be modified to be able to play sense around, and that often meant rows of seats had to be removed to accommodate the large subwoofers. Today, subwoofers are a standard part of movie theater sound systems, and low-frequency effects like rumbles and earthquakes, explosions, gunshots, and crashes are included in almost all movie soundtracks. Thanks, Mr. Audio. For more interesting facts about sound, visit Mr. Audio at soundimages.com.